moolahguides.com from Florida State University. How are you guys all doing today? I'd like to first start off by saying thank you all for coming and having us all here. Now, by a show of hands, how many of you knew you can make a whole lot of money selling your notes online? I'm not seeing any hands, only a few out there. For those of you who didn't know, and for the judges who don't know, students can make a whole lot of money selling their study guides and notes online, especially using my service, moolahguides.com. Students in the past two years at Florida State University have profited over $300,000 using my service. Now you're probably asking, what is moolahguides.com and what do you do? Moolahguides.com is an online marketplace for the buying and selling of study materials online. We are a website created by students, for students, in an attempt to truly make studying pay off. My name is Thomas Brady, no affiliation with the quarterback. However, I like to consider myself the shorter but better looking version of him. I am founder of CEO of moolahguides.com. I am graduating this June from Florida State University with degrees in entrepreneurship and international affairs. I have a strong passion for innovation and for entrepreneurship. I have a strong board of advisors made up of Mr. F Mr. Robert Ford and Ms. Kalikoff. Mr. Ford is a former CEO of DuPont, has raised over $27 million in capital, and has a large technical background. Ms. Palikoff is a branding and marketing expert and has held, has held multiple top positions at successful enterprises throughout her career. Students across the nation all strive for two common goals, financial stability and good grades. Moolahguides.com is the tool for students to use in order to accomplish these tasks. We do this by offering extra study materials for upcoming exams, as well as a new way for students to be rewarded financially for their academic efforts today. Now you're probably asking, how do you guys make money? Moolahguides.com receives 20% commission per transaction. What that means for you students is that you guys receive 80% transaction for using my website every single time. We have two types of users, student sellers and student buyers. The student sellers are able to upload their documents onto the website, list the price themselves, promote the documents, and walk away 80% richer every single time. Student buyers are able to search, purchase, download, and study, all within a matter of a couple of minutes anywhere they have access to the internet. A key aspect of our business model is the exposure through our student sellers. They must promote the documents themselves, because after all, they know how best to reach their class. A great example of how to promote your document is to send out an email to your class. Florida State last year, we had a girl who uploaded a document. She sent out one email to her class, took approximately 30 seconds, and throughout the course of a week, she sold over 170 documents, profiting over $1,100 in one week from one test. There are currently over 4,000 universities throughout the nation, educating over 21 million students. There's two key factors about this business and this target market. One, this market's replenishable. As seniors graduate, a new level of freshmen come in taking their spot. Also, these users are already, these students are already developing this content with or, with or without my service on their campus. They just need to be educated about moolahguides.com and realize that they have nothing to lose but everything to gain by using my service. Since we started in 2010, late 2010, we've sold over 50,000 study guides. We've accumulated a, na a nationwide user base of over 21,000 students representing over 40 campuses. We've also received over 4,300 documents onto our website, profiting students over $330,000. Over $330, the following are the statistics from our past year with Moolah Guides. I'd like you to pay close attention to the page views as well as the average visit duration. The average visit duration is expected to jump up to over 10 minutes in the upcoming months because of two new features we're having come out in the next week. The ability to create and sell flashcards, as well as the ability to create and sell videos. The videos will be crucial for STEM majors, such as sciences, technology, engineering, and mathematics. They will finally be able to utilize my service and reap the financial benefits. In 2012, we had over $200,000 in revenue, meaning students profited over $160,000 using my service. In 2013, we are projecting over $500,000, with students earning over $400,000. By the end of 2015, off organic growth and conservative conversion rates, students are going to earn over $1 million. It sounds crazy, but I want to live in a crazy world where students are paid annually over $1 million simply by using my service. When expanding to new universities, because our industry is relatively unknown and extremely young, only been around for probably three years, there are only two major competitors, 
the local university bookstores who have notes that they sell, as well as stu uh, students trying to sell the documents themselves. These local university bookstores have an outdated model. They pay an extremely low commission to their note takers, and not to mention, if you want to buy the document, you got to go to the store and actually pick it up. And if students are trying to sell the documents themselves, they're quick to realize how timely and tedious and costly it is to do so. Oftentimes, they wait at the library for up to five hours, hoping students come with the exact change. I like to think of the Cupid's Cup very similar to college football. Mr. Plank, sitting down with you is the national championship. Winning the cash prize of Cupid's Cup is like the Rose Bowl. All the teams here want the national championship, but hey, we'd be happy going to the Rose Bowl. Mr. Plank, sitting down with you would be invaluable to moolahguys.com. I would love to pick your brain in regards to investment, marketing, branding, and how I could get to some of the universities that are currently sponsored by Under Armour, which is 17, I know it to be exact. With the $50,000 in cash prize, moolahguys.com would delegate all that to four universities that fall underneath the Under Armour umbrella. These four universities collectively will add $200,000 to our bottom line by the end of this year. We have a proven business model that is extremely scalable, and we truly believe that studying should be a student's only job. After all, that's why we go to college. Thank you very much. Good job, Tom. Thank you very much. We, ha we have a relationship with the other Tom as well. <laughs> we, we, we pay him also. Right? Well, just to let you know, I'm up and coming, and I'm planning to be the number one Tom Brady in a few years. Uh, okay. It's going it's to be hard. <laughs> Trust me. But you may as well set your, your bar high. Are you dating? I am. I am. And my girlfriend is just as beautiful as Giselle. Yeah, okay. All right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no more questions. <laughs> How, you How do you assure the quality of the study notes that are uploaded to your web page? Because surely you want to give quality as part of your service. That's actually a great question. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Students are actually highly encouraged and self-motivated to upload the number one and the best content that they can do. Because if they develop the best content and upload it, students will actually buy their documents time and time again. Our best sellers often have a following. They receive emails weeks in advance of before the exams, at students asking them, when are you coming out with your study guides? And we also have a rating system as well as a trophy and ribbon system that will be displayed later this week when we come out with our huge update. How have you, what is your plan for going to other universities? It seems like you have a great kind of ecosystem at Florida State around folks knowing and using this service, but mm -hmm. I imagine the value would be in having a university have you know, hundreds if not thousands of students using the service at once. Mm -hmm. So what is your plan for going to a new university and getting that kind of traction mm -hmm. immediately? MoolahGuys.com is looking to set up exclusive relationships with student organizations on campuses. What we're looking to offer is for a certain allotted time, the members of that organization, if they use our service and the profit that, they, that MoolahGuys.com generates from mm -hmm. their members, we are going to donate back to the organization as for them to use for whatever they want, be it philanthropy, or be it you know, throwing a huge party for the fraternity. But we're really looking to give back to the university and making ourselves a campus household name. Do you host it yourself or use Rackspace or Amazon? We're currently using Amazon Web Service. The past two years, our site actually crashed during midterms and finals due to the high traffic that we've had. So we quickly learned our lesson, and Amazon Web Service is able to scale due to the amount of traffic that we currently receive. So are people subscribing to use the web page, or are they paying just to get the notes? Students, it's completely free to use our website. It's completely free to upload the documents. And if you're just looking to browse, there's no charge. The only time you're going to spend money is if you're actually buying documents. If you're not buying the documents, I'm actually paying you to use my website. So no subscription fee. Tom, what are you doing in five years? In five years, I'm looking to have a few successful businesses underneath my name. And I would love to be working six months in America, six months somewhere else, really making a huge impact throughout the world. Very cool, man. Congratulations. Thanks very much, Tom. Thank Good you luck. very much. Good luck. Thank you, guys.